Okay, bromies and hoes. That's right. You heard me. I said it. Choose your category and fit into it. <clears throat> For realsies, though, I'm not falling asleep. Sucks. Yes, I need underwear. Yes. There ain't no two ways about it. It's a freaking cold house, man. This is so odd, dude. In that little amount of time from, what, half past three to four, this thing went all the way up to 58%. Why does it spend a whole night and only get through one and a half videos, but then I can leave it for half an hour and it gets approximately 10%. Oh, so it's... I have done a whole bunch of editing over these hours and I'm only 11 minutes through on a 41 minute video. The thing is this from yesterday's vlog onwards is where I started being a bit better with the camera. And that's why it's taking me so long to edit this because I'm having to cut and dive into all important stuff. I have downloaded the second Starbound episode and I am now putting it up online. 44 views, give me one second. 44 views in one day. In one day, 44 views. Oh, I also did just all the usual norm stuff of all of my morning routines and also all of my WhatsApps. WhatsApps and stuffs like that. I have four and a fifth videos ready and waiting to be compressed. I'm leaving them to do their thing while I go out to the practical. So I need to pack the car, make sure I've got everything, make sure all the lights are off, etc., etc. And then we're going to the practicals. We're gonna go fly some drones, because My car won't start and it looks like I left this fucking light on a fucking again, dude. Why do I fucking do that? Jesus fucking Christ. Thank God I have this thing. Ay ay ay, caramba. Why do I put that on even? What the hell? Let's pop the frickin' bonnet, get this frickin' thing, close the frickin' door on this frickin' tiny ass frickin' driveway. Open this frickin' thing. And here we go again. BTW, something really stinks of dog shit. Let this thing sizzle. Look, it's staying pretty much on 25%, which is another thing. I don't know why this is on 25%. Um, but it's staying still, which means this. Okay, here we go. Open the car, get inside. Let's try. Thank God. Now let's get this thing inside the car. Ah. This freaking GPS is not worth zero minutes until destination. Bruh. I need to try and get this on guitar again. The kilometers are one nine four one four nine. drums as well, this part in particular. Yeah, we have arrived. I'm now just waiting for the security guys to come open the gate 
and I'm waiting for the actual students to rock up. They are refresher students, so today's not going to be a big day, but it is going to at least have to spend some time here to get the students to the point where they can pass the skills test. So this is the place, by the way. This is what the place looks like, by the way. This is Moda Fontaine Model Aero Club. It's a freaking terrible road. I once had my tire completely blown as I came down this road so bad that I actually had to stop the car in the middle of the road and change my tire in the middle of the road. Wow, these guys got here. So I literally just called them and they're already here. I'm now waiting for the students to rock up. This dude was literally two seconds. But it turns out the gate was unlocked anyways. I am still waiting for these students, by the way. I have no clue where they are. I also do have income building up on the on my PayPal. With this Udemy course I've got up, every single month I've at least got at least something coming. That will be if there's something that I need done that I can hire someone internationally for, I will pay them using PayPal. So my second Udemy course is gonna benefit from my first Udemy course getting free. That's why I set my first Udemy course at so cheap, but I think that has hindered it. I think setting it so cheap makes people see that price and think this guy doesn't have faith in the course. So I'm going to raise the price back up to what it was initially. I'm also thinking of starting a, a drone, a teaching YouTube channel, which I think I mentioned yesterday. The first thing I need to do, Apart from finishing the second course, because I need to still do a lot of editing there. But apart from finishing that course, that first course needs to make changes. We need to make amendments and we're going to do that today. I'm going to drive up. I'm going to check it. If nobody's there, I'm going to give the office a call. If the office says some, something like we don't know where they are, blah, 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 then I'm probably just going to leave. Okay, wait. For all the upsides of this freaking this phone car holder here, all the positive feedback I have to give it, the one thing I can't stand about these things is that they're never made properly. I've now gone and broken this thing again. And there you have it. This is South Africa 101. Let's go. Maybe I should move my seat forward. Okay, let's hit up this road. You can check this road for yourself. It's crazy stuff is what it is. My little Hyundai on this road. You're nuts, dude. You're nuts. You're actually nuts, man. Okay, what is playing? Is it you too? But I want to... Yes. Nah, not this one. Um... Hell yeah, fam. Check the view as well. And then it's all foggy and actually it's smoggy. In the name of love, one love, the name of love. In the name of love, one love, the name of love. <laughs> Working as a drone pilot means that I am always on roads like this. This little beautiful beast has to hit roads like that almost on a daily basis. I don't get paid for the scratches. I don't get paid for the tire damage. That tire, that tire that was completely burst, I saw zero cents remuneration for so, that. So that over there is the Calvin power station. That big thing over there, releasing a shit ton of smoke. 
which I wish it wouldn't, but it does. And then you've got the runway here. And that is the runway right there. Got a little taxi service. This serves no purpose except to show off. Model runway shows before they taxi onto the runway and then take off. You've also got your windsock. There used to be a lot more grass this way. There isn't any more. They've burnt it all down. But you can see how quickly it just grows right back. And then my car is just parked over there. So I'm going to give the office a call and see what's going on. If they're late and they're not here by 10 o'clock, I'm going to leave. I have some more freaking cool news. I am staying another night at this house. The answering surface four, zero, six, seven. Dude, have I entered an alternate universe? Things are being so strange today. Melinda is normally super talkative and today her messages are like one message. Also, other people are doing a similar thing where they talk a lot and now normally, and now it's just like quick messages. These guys aren't showing up, but this was planned for weeks. Um, now people at the office who always answer their calls are not answering calls. I feel like I've stepped into an alternate time zone. And I'm going to stick to my word. I'll try and call one more. But it is 10 o'clock. What the? Sh Am I in another reality? What the hell is going This, this one that I called now, this colleague of mine, I have never had her miss a call. Am I missing something? I feel like maybe I'm missing something. Is there a meeting? But I was supposed to be here. I don't know what is going on. Didn't answer. I can't show names. I can't show names, but didn't answer. I'm flabbergasted. This is a work day. This is not holiday. It feels like I stepped into a time zone where it's a holiday, but this is a work day, but nobody is responding. So the me. car starts and here we are going. <laughs> So these guys are just burning stuff in these creeks here and it smells terrible. It smells like burning flesh. We are back at Benmore shopping center because I need to replace the spatula that I burnt. Sure, dude, that's very nice. Huh. Okay, let's go. And there it is. So it turns out if you buy something for pick and pay, you don't actually have to pay the parking. Scan this code for the discount. Now, I wish I knew this last time because I did buy from pick and pay. This time, I don't need to because I'm going to be within the 15 minutes. Ah, <laughs> oh, man, that sucks. 
kilometers, 194188. Now you're just somebody that I used to know. Somebody I used to know. Somebody. So I'm not very good with my parking. Actually, no, I'm okay with my parking tickets, but it's better if someone else has it. One day, my sister and I went to the shopping center and we got the parking ticket and I didn't give it to my sister and that was the first mistake because I then put it in my pocket and that was the second mistake because I then started moving my pants around as we walked through this place like sitting down and bending over and stuff like that so this part and that was all my third mistakes because then this ticket at the end was unreadable I tried with the tickets and then we tried contacting and blah 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 things weren't working out eventually we said now fuck this dude I'm gonna pull into the entrance Lara got out, she went, she pressed, she got a ticket, and I drove out of the entrance. So we, end, we ended up leaving with two tickets because we just went through the exit, we went in by the exit, and we went out by the exit. I don't know why we tried it a second time. I'm pretty sure it's because I had the parking good ticket again. <laughs> oh, that's right. We didn't have cash. We didn't have cash on us and we had to pay for the parking ticket. So instead, we were trying to get out of it. And... We were going to do that by doing that entrance thing again, the entrance exit, as it shall forever now be known as, is the entrance exit. Uh, but we got caught, we got busted, and then we had to, we swindled our way out of it, but then we, we drove around, waited for people to leave, we tried again, we got busted again. I don't remember what we did. I think I found some cash in my car. We were proper, proper stuck. You'd think people would make an exception if you absolutely cannot get out. Because the more you're in there, the more you have to pay. And the more we had to pay, the more we didn't have money to pay it. It was just such a freaking mess, dude. Eventually, eventually we solved it. And I think it was because I found money in my car. If we have today to do stuff, then I'm going to go and get... It's Emma's birthday party tomorrow. It's Emma's birthday party tomorrow evening. And then Mike has a house party on Saturday. Now, I don't have to get anything for Mike's party. I can just rock up and bring myself. But for Emma's party, considering it's a birthday celebration, even though it's late, like she had her birthday in May. But the very least I can do is show her my appreciation for her friendship and get her something for her birthday. So I'm going to do that now while we're in the area well we're not really in the area but we're going to be passing through that area then i'll do the unimi course then i'll send the unimi course to gavin and then we can get on with the rest of our day we have officially hit 194 194 okay so i've got the gift for emma emma it's the place where you broke a freaking thing I spoke to him about it today and he says don't stress about it. He has a clumsy daughter. <laughs> this is his buggy actually. Check this thing out. He drove to freaking work today in this thing. What a freaking legend. I'm going to now, now we're going to head, let's put, let's put the jams. I'm now going to head to back home, do the Unimi course stuff, get that out the way then deal with whatever comms have come my way over the morning, then deal with my own work stuff. Cops are doing some sort of escort. Oh, I don't know if you guys can actually see that, but I know you can sort of see them. Except normally they would have just cut the robots. I wonder why they're stopped. Got 
<laughs> what the time? Yeah. It's 12 past 11. No, no, it's 11 o'clock.